Hello everybody, hope you all are fine and safe during this COVID crisis. So it is a very uh, tough situation, tough time we are passing through. So today I'm here to just share some ideas about uh, the germ theories. Actually we feel that or we believe that germs or I mean virus or germs or bacteria, they enters our body and we become vulnerable. So my question is, is it inevitable that the germs automatically enter our body or our body invites germ? There's a big question. Maybe we sometimes don't think that because we believe in some theories which actually tells us that germ enters our body and it can make our body vulnerable and uh, we become very much stressful for that and eventually it hurts our life. But you look at the history, what the history say. So if you look at the, the, the germ theory given by Louis Pasteur, he said that germ enters our body. And if you cannot kill the germ, it may be harmful for our body and life eventually. But if you look at another theory, which people usually don't talk about, which is soil theory which has been given by another fine uh, French scientist uh, Anthony Besson. He said germ never enters our body if our body remains in a homeostatic state. So you see this is a big difference. If we can keep ourselves fit then germ will not invite. So Anthony Besson said if we are not in a homeostatic state, if we have a lot of toxins in our body, he said actually that the toxins, these are the, the disease, these are the sources of the disease, which is called toxamia. So if the body suffers from toxamia, then any time, any germ, bacteria or virus can enter, which together are called pathogens. So any pathogen can enter our body and then, of course, the body will be vulnerable. So how we can keep ourselves safe? The first thing is precaution. Fine. We know that WHO and the governments, they are always sharing this information that keep yourself safe. How? Protect yourself. Don't go to the touch of other people. Make a social distance and use the mask and use sanitization. So a lot of things, precautionary measures are there. But beyond that, what we can do? If the germ attacks us, then we have to think, we have to keep the germ, our body must not allow the germ. How? We have to keep it in homeostatic state. How? Because we, this body, so see the fundamental truth, this body is a natural thing. So we we'll try to depend on the natural thing try to eat the natural thing, try to do some exercise, try to, try to uh, go under the sunshine, so maintain all these things to have a very homeostatic state. It will conserve your vitality. If your vitality is conserved more and more, then your toxemia will be reduced, then you will be safer from germ. The body will not allow germ to enter into the body. So, you can go in both the ways. You can protect yourself, but it is not the ultimate world, ultimate uh, actually measure, because you don't know. Even, even if you are uh, trying to keep yourself safe by uh, just taking some of the measures like uh, protection, uh, like using a mask and social distancing, so these are good. But if the germ eventually comes to your body, or eventually comes near by you, how your body will protect it. Body itself should protect. So that is what I am talking about. So body must be in homeostatic state. So don't try to eat anything which is not natural. Suppose so avoid the processed things. Do some exercise. Sleep on time. Don't take any panic in your head or in your brain. And through this process, you will find that 
uh, you will be little bit stronger your vitality will be a uh, little bit uh, actually uh, uh, it better the conservation will be little bit uh, high so then uh, this vitality conserve vitality will work to fight or to protect your body from the germs from the virus or from the bacteria so that's all this is what i actually try to explain you got the point that means we will just take some precautions the external precaution that's fine but at the same time let us try to make our body very much fit i mean let us try to uh, uh, put our body in a homeostatic state that will be the best way thank you very much so maybe uh, very soon i will come up with another video for uh, just sharing some exciting information with you